Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to some more Mass Effect 2. We just got done with Kasumi's Stolen Memory DLC, but uh, we're not done with DLCs just yet. What is this? Why is my squad thing? Do I got squad points? Did I level it up? Did my Xbox just freeze? No, it didn't. It was close. Ooh, flashbang grenade. Looks like I can get this too. Alright, let's go ahead and upgrade that. Why not? Bam. Uh, codex, we can mark all these viewed. I don't really read those. Sorry if you guys want me to. Uh, so missions. We're not going to do missions. I don't think it's going to be. Ooh, maybe we will. We don't have it. No, we have no assignments. Okay. We are going to do Zaid's The Price of Revenge. And, uh, let's go ahead and give you a little brief, uh, of this. So, before he was hired by Serbius, um, Zaid, or Zaid, I don't know how to pronounce it. So, just, I'm going to call him Zaid. Zaid had taken a mission to go to Zoria and liberate the Elderfell Ashland Refinery from the Blue Suns. Once his work there is done, he can dedicate his full attention to the mission. Alright. Um, we're gonna do that. Where does it say we need to go? <laughs> um, in other ones, we have all these new ones, but I'm not gonna read them. We'll read them later. Alright. Travel to Zoria. Faya something frontier. Oh god. Hopefully there, there's a little symbol that tells me where to go. There's no way I'm going to know. Okay, mass relay. Help Morden. Help Miranda. Give Lyra intel. Recruit. Recruit. How's Zaid over here? Or Zaid. I don't know how to pronounce it. Oh, it's over here actually. I lied. Nope. It's over here. I was, I was right the first time. And there I go. It's nice that it's so much quieter than the first one. We have zero percent here. As uh, well, I will. I'll do this off camera, of course. I will probably explore these off camera, just like I normally been doing lately. So you guys don't get B O R E D. Um, let's go all the way to Faya. 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 I obviously I don't know it, so um. Just don't mind me. Uh, let's go right. Ooh, look how small this fucking planet is. I'm gonna have to uh, scan this just because it's so small and it just it's making me go crazy right now. I gotta scan this. You guys gonna watch me scan this little planet? You know, if you don't like it, I'm sorry. It's a tiny little planet. I wanna. This thing's like smaller than Pluto. I mean, come on, smaller than our moon. I swear, it's rich too, but I'm not getting much. Doesn't seem like, anyways. There we go. Woo! Probe away. Probe away. There we go. Put this one right here. Ooh. Probe away. Probe away. Continue looking. I guess right here, I mean, I, I really, sh I really should have wasted a probe on that since I've already have a shit ton of iridium and it wasn't gonna give me much. Like this one, hell yeah, it's gonna give me a lot. It's probably put me in the 180s, maybe. Nah, I doubt it. Oh, actually, I was right. I don't need iridium. I need element zero. Where can I find element zero? You guys know a good place to find that, so I can never find it. It's like the toughest thing to find on this game. I swear. Alright, leave orbit. I just had to do that small planet because it's so cute. Alright, into orbit. We don't gotta scan this planet. We're just gonna land on it. And this guy's gonna come with us and we're gonna do stuff. I believe this is a DLC as well. One of the DLCs that might have came with the Serbius network. And I can tell you that in a second. Yeah, yeah, you get this one. It's free with the Serbius network. I think if you don't have the Serbius network, it's I think it might be like 500 Microsoft points or something. Um, okay, we're gonna take him up, obviously. Oh, look at cycle appearances. This is how you do it. Oh, sweet. Yeah, you're gonna be wearing that red one. Let's take him and Morden. If I can take more than, all right, that's fine. We'll go with us two, these two. I think with obviously with Kasumi, it, could, it was only me and her that could go through. It was on that on that DLC. But on this one, I could take someone else. We're gonna take Morden. I haven't. I don't know if I took him in a while or not. I'm just gonna take him with me. 
Um, let's go ahead and give him one of these. And then we'll spend it on that because we he doesn't need both. There we go. Uh, is it Yi? We're going to put you one on right here. Or is it Yi? I don't know his name again. And yeah, let's go get him a, concuss a concussive shot. Alright, let's do this. Whoop, sorry, I hit my mic. You guys heard that? I apologize. Alright, liberate the refinery. Find the entrance to the refinery and liberate the workers from Blue Suns. Stay tight and look out for ambushes. Well, do we automatically get our guns on this one? Um, I'm just gonna see if there's anything back here. We got some kind of. You guys might not be able to hear it because I kind of buffered you guys so you guys can hear me better. We got kind of some awesome background music. It's like boom, 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 boom. You guys might not be able to hear it though. It sounds pretty awesome, though, I'm not gonna lie. So we have dead bodies ahead. Let's go ahead and investigate that. This is probably gonna be an ambush, I bet. Guessing down here. All right. Command to Bravo. Take a position. Likely these people are not runaways. Dude, look at that thing. <laughs> that is. That's what I was talking about before in Mass Effect One. I was talking about why isn't there different wildlife on these planets that we've never seen before. Here we are, another planet. Look at this. That is a creature that you would not find on Earth. Interesting. Report to base. Armed intruders incoming at the southern checkpoint. Taking cover. Incoming. Oh. I think I need to put a shot on this. Ooh, look at all this sweets. What is this? A massive blast that propels enemies with a bone crushing force. When did I get this? Flashbang grenade. We have a lot of stuff for me. <laughs> it's a little unfair. I kind of want to use my uh, fire ammo on these guys. Hard time shooting you because you're glitching out up there, sir. There we go. Please kill him with that fire. Oh, he's like a one shot. There we go. Not difficult. Reinforcements incoming. We got your backs. There we go. Med kit over here. Howie. I don't know what these people are using. Oh, nice. Froze him. He should be about dead. Let me get rid of that mech. There's a PDA that we're going to grab in a second. Just the thing to help. Nice. That helps out a lot when my teammates freeze him. Good stuff, guys. I like that. All right, let's continue. Bridge controls. Activate. This is Commander Santiago. If any of you retreat while the intruders are still alive, I'll kill you myself. Now get the hell back out there. Vito, 
Sounds like he hasn't changed. I get the feeling you have a past with this Vito. I knew he was a sadistic bastard back when we started the Blue Suns. The Suns only got meaner after he staged his little coup 20 years ago. So, yeah, we have a past. Why didn't anyone tell me you founded the Blue Suns? Because it's not common knowledge. Vito wiped me out of the records. He ran the books, I let the men. Worked real well for a while. Then Vito decided to start hiring Batarians. Cheaper labor, he said. Goddamn terrorists, I said. Twenty years is a long time to hold a grudge. A grudge? Vito turned my men against me. He paid six of them to restrain me while he put a gun to my head and pulled the trigger. For twenty years I've seen that bastard every time I closed my eyes. Every time I sighted down on a target. Every time I heard a gunshot. Don't you call that a goddamn grudge? You survived a gunshot to the head? Yeah. And you survived your ship getting disintegrated. A stubborn enough person can survive just about anything. Rage is a hell of an anesthetic. We'd better get moving. So apparently we stopped the bridge to talk. All squads mass at the gatehouse. Now! They know we're here. Bring it on, you All right, let's let's uh let's rip this guy a new one. Let's fuck him up. I saw some palladium over here. We're gonna grab four hundred of that. Yay! And we have a door. Where does this door lead? Open up. Oh, hello, sexy. Just kidding. Don't be stupid, Zaid. I have a whole company of bloodthirsty bastards behind me, ready to kill or be killed on my command. Actually, take your shot. Give my men a reason to put you down like the mad dog you are again. What was that? Got nearsighted, old friend. Burn, you son of a bitch. Just signed your death warrant, Masani. What the hell are you doing? Apparently, that opening the gate. We don't sacrifice lives for the sake of the mission. There's always a better way. Like what? Wandering out in the jungle for hours looking for another way in. You want to waste time out here? Go ahead. I'm going to kill Vito. You're endangering lives and the mission for your own selfish revenge. You really want to do this, Shepard? I had to knock you the hell out. But thanks to you, we have a burning refinery to save. Let these people burn. Vito dies, whatever the cost. Alright, I just whacked him a new one. <laughs> no, I seriously did just whack him up. Of course, you guys should have saw that. If not, we're... Making what just happened? Contact. You guys blink? I'm surprised I got that because I was reading a text message real fast. Just a little cutscene was going on. And I was like, oh shit, let's figure out. I think I got the last second. Jeez, my phone keeps vibrating. Stop it, you. Stop it. Palladium, yay! Door, open up, brah! Whoa, what was that? Who are you? Help! We're trapped! We can't get to the gas valves to shut them off! The whole place is gonna blow! No time. Vito's probably halfway to the shuttle docks by now. You're willing to watch these people die? Damn right I am. We stop to help these people and Vito gets away. And if he gets away, I'm blaming you. We're here to free these people. We're going in. I knew this was a mistake. 